Ash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo, the Lucky Ferals. It is 8.53 a.m. and today is the first day the cats are really trying the new homemade raw food, the one that I made off of the recipe on the internet. And this is what happened. So this one was Stella's, the one on the right. Stella did not finish her food, so that's rare for Stella. She usually loves her food. And then this one was Simba's and it looks like Simba ate um, I put like a dried minnow on there and a bitchin' field treat and it looks like he ate those and he left um, pretty much almost all of the food on the plate. So Stella and Simba were not really fans of this. This is Splash's plate. So Boo was sitting on the top of the stairs and he was not letting Splash downstairs to eat. So Splash decided he was going to eat uh, under the dining room table. And it looks like out of everyone, Splash enjoyed it the most. Uh, he ate the most of his food. This is Boo's food. He did not want to eat it downstairs. He did not want to eat it in the living room. So I put it in his room. He followed me into his room. I shut the door and he's been in here about 10 minutes with his food and he's not eating it either. Like he's not even touching it. Boo is not even eating the crunchies off the top of it. So um. I don't know if they're going to grow to like this food more or if they just don't like it. So when I normally make uh, homemade raw food, it's usually mostly chicken, which this is. This is mostly chicken. The one big difference is this has a bunch of egg yolks in it. And the other difference is that this has just vitamin supplements versus whole food supplements. So, so it looks like the cats don't like this version of homemade raw. I just gave the plate to Stella and Simba in the living room since they didn't finish their meal. And Simba's smart. He's going to dig out the treats that he wants off the top of it. Yeah, he's going for some of the treats. Whatever other cats don't eat, I'm going to scrape onto a plate and um, give to Hydrox and Ditto outside. Every now and then I get messages from people saying they would like their cats to eat a raw food diet, but their cats refuse to eat it. Their cats don't like it. Their cats won't eat it. Well, I think this recipe is a good example of why cats might not like a raw food diet. I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with this recipe. I'm just observing that the cats don't like this recipe, so they're not eating it. And if this was maybe the first recipe I tried with raw food for my cats, I might think, well, my cats just don't like raw food. They just don't like it. Um, and that's not the case at all. It's They just don't like this recipe. So if you want to get your cats to eat more raw food or uh, put them on a raw food diet, you have to kind of play with recipes or if you're buying the raw food, you have to buy different types. It's about 6.45 p.m. right now. Boo's getting really good at getting crunchies out. See how good he is at this? Boo is as good at this one as Stella is as good on the other one. I have to find the other one. I put it away and I don't remember where I put it. It's in a closet somewhere. I'm just not sure which closet.
Did you see what he just did? He got crutches out of two at the same time. Hello, Simba. You could eat those. Be careful you don't get bopped, though. Hello, Stella. Let's find your crunch. Stella has her crunchy dispenser, and Boo has his. And Simba's purring. Is Stella going to remember how to use hers? Want me to move it around for you, Stella? There. There you go, Stella. I just pointed it at you. You gonna get the crunchies out? Do you remember? She's very close. She remembers. Is it working? I hope the battery's not dead. Oh no, the battery's probably dead. It's been a long time. I heard it going. You had it, Stella. You had it, I heard it, but the battery's dead. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta put a battery in. You want to get some crunchies out, Stella? You going to get some crunchies out? You could do it. You remember how to do it.
You're not going to get any of here. Look, Stella, look. She got him. She remembered. Took a little reminding, but she got him. Now she got a lot. Cats are so smart. Here's Splash, he's watching. He wants Stella to give him some of the crunchies. And here's Simba, he's watching also. He's looking at Splash. I think it's too easy for her now.
Thank you for watching this Lucky Pearls video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.